Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for January the 27th of 2021. Well, it is titled the vertical magnetic field of NGC 5775. So what do we see here? Well, the underlying image is that of a spiral galaxy known by the catalog designation of NGC 5775. We see that's flattened into a disk and that is because we are seeing it edge on tilted so that we are seeing the very narrow region and gives it sort of a resemblance to many of the images that we see of our own Milky Way. And that's because we see our Milky Way in an edge on view as well simply because we are inside the disk of the galaxy. Now all of the tendrils stretching out of it are the representation showing the magnetic field lines. And it's very interesting and something that has only been studied relatively recently. Well, for a while, we've known that some galaxies did have magnetic fields, but not that they would stretch this far away from the disk. And you can see that they're going a good percentage of the disk up there many tens of thousands of light years upwards. And that is something that astronomers wish to study better to really be able to learn about these. Now they can learn about them and have only learned about them recently because of uh, better instrumentation and upgrades to various radio telescopes like the VLA. And that was then be able to better study how electrons move. And electrons move very fast close to the speed of light. And they spiral around magnetic field lines. So they trace out the magnetic field lines much as iron filings do for the magnetic field lines of a bar magnet. So we can use the emission of those electrons which emit radio waves that can then be detected by the radio telescopes and we can use that to trace out the magnetic field. And more recent observations have shown how far above and below the galaxies these can extend. So hopefully that will better be able to let us understand how the magnetic fields within these galaxies work because it is not something that is completely uh, understood at this time. So we get to see the underlying image of the spiral galaxy uh, with the great dust lanes and pink hydrogen regions associated with star formation. But on top of that, we get to see the uh, tracing out of the magnetic field line something relatively new that we're now able to study a little bit better and hopefully give us a better picture of galaxies like this. So that was our picture of the day for January the 27th of 2021. It was titled the vertical magnetic field of NGC 5775. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.